There's no just slipping a pedal. It's do or die. There it is. Oh, he nails it. There's nothing in the world that can get you ready for this. We're in Nijmegen, the Netherlands, and we're standing in an old paper factory. I think they had thousands of employees working here for years, and then one day it got shut down and it was an empty building, so it's the perfect spot for an event for Red Bull. Red Bull Uncontained was a brainchild from a project that I got to do a few years back called Red Bull Uncontainable. Um, just riding a lot bigger setups on a BMX bike, which allowed us to kind of push the sport of BMX. And now Red Bull Uncontained, um, amazing opportunity and being able to ride this once in a lifetime course. Well, without a doubt, you know, when the riders got here, I think it's fair to say that the scale of that course really took their breath away. But they've had plenty of time. They've been having a week on it now. So they've really got up to speed on it. They're starting to feel confident with it. It asks them to go big. It asks them to roll the dice and take some chances. Well, this is big. So the event is two teams, eight of the best BMX riders on the planet. And it's a park course, but this is a park course with a real difference. It's the biggest course we've ever seen, and it's on two levels. Usually a course is on one level, but here we've got the bottom section, which is huge, and then a top section, and then jumps linking and linking them both together. At events like this, this is where we see the sport taken to the next level. The, the, the riders get given the opportunity to really go for the tricks they've always wanted to try, and this is where the magic happens. This is where the world first come out. The sport could be changed tonight, forever. This event is super special because of the team aspect. Like, we never really get that in BMX. It's always us versus everybody else. And with the team, it's, it's special. You have that camaraderie between the riders, everybody's bonding, and it takes a little bit of weight off our shoulders knowing that we're all doing a little bit of the work, not we have to do it all ourselves. Yeah, Tom. Picking the team, that, that was a hard one. I needed riders in every category, like style, tricks, going big, but then also knowing the course was gonna be this big, I needed riders being able to jump this big thing. So yeah, I think I have a great team now and everyone's killing it. On my team, I have Morgan Wade, Pat Casey, Tom Vandebogard, Jason Watts, Kieran Riley, Eric Resolu, and Alex Goldborn. For the team, got Ben Wallace, Tom Justice, Declan Brooks, Paul Tula, Jake Leva, Marvin Rantes, and Anthony Shanshan. Execution, variety, use of course, style and gut to the five the judges are looking at. A rider needs to win three of those, of course, to get the majority and to take the win of that heat. We've just had round one. This BMX Park contest, two teams of riders going head to head, and there's Daniel's riders he's picked for this big trick round that is coming up. Eight minutes now for these riders to show us what they've got, and all they need is the best trick to get those points. The Pat Casey's a strong contender in this contest. 360 bars been to double tail whip. Pulled it. Incredible. Oh my goodness, he really did gamble there. That is pretty much one of the biggest tricks in BMX. Kieran Riley, I think he's looking to that double whip to late bar. There it is. Oh, and he nails it. Here we go, 720. No! Oh! Huge. Well, let's see what Eric Reserve has got then. Oh, wow. Back with tail to late, no hand, down into the... Bottom and that's section. how you get back to the top quick. <laughs> he doesn't need the elevator. <laughs> no. Whoa. Oh! 
Belgium. Look at where Drew is. Ah! Oh, how did he get there? Oh my goodness, Where's what's he, he going to do? Oh my word, Bart's been into the top section of the course. 360 whip track. Oh. Backflip Bart's been to turn down from Drew. Rob, that is so scary up there. <laughs> Don't have to tell me. Look Where's at him, what's he doing? Oh my word! 270 dropping on that sub rail. I feel pretty solid right now. Like, for a second there, I was like, you know, I pat slam super hard. I'm in a little rough condition. And then, I mean, I can't be more stoked than my dudes because they're, they're putting it together when it counts. Red Bull uncontained is going off. And here is Team Daniel. And interesting, they're not all just dropping it out the top of the tower. No, it's smart, isn't it? They've got guys up there on, in the big section, and then they've got a crew over here in the top section taking care of business. Look at that. No, why? Huge ice pick. No, he's on the sub route. 360 tire tap to turn down oh, in. Pulled it. You really got a good shot there of how big that drop is on the other side. No joke. Bruised and bad from practice here this week, this man, but riding beautifully tonight, putting all that behind him, and he's got to be sore. Are you oh. kidding me? Over ice pick on that back rail. Judges will be loving that. Look at that. Oh, whoa! Oh. Wow. Big moves here, yeah. yeah. 360 triple whip. Stomps it. No! Are you kidding me? He's got some big tricks, this kid. And now's the time to use them as he heads down the roll in. What was that? Backflip, double tail whip. Stomped. There you go. As he heads towards the sub rail. 360. Oh, no way! That was ridiculous! Oh, my goodness me. I did not expect to see that. Here we go, 360 tire tap. No! Double tail. Oh, no! so close! Last attempt from Jake Liver. Everyone's watching this one. Can he pull it? On the... Oh! Yes! Oh, my... That was phenomenal. <laughs> I don't know where his bike ended up, possibly on the top of our commentary box by that noise that just came in. Look at the reaction for the riders. <laughs> I Team did not Daniel. expect that. I did not expect that at all. That was incredible. <laughs> that was bonkers. Man, since I showed up, if there's not a better spot to do it, it's right here. The whole time I was thinking, all right, I just want to get to this three tap double. I think Jake did the biggest trick of the event already, and we're not even halfway through, so I can't even imagine what's going what else is gonna happen. This is insane, man. Insane. So, after round one, Team Drew, Team Daniel, neck and neck on four. Five points on offer in this round two. Which way is it going to go? Team Drew, take execution. Variety goes to Daniel. Use of course. Style to Drew. Guts goes to Daniel, but Team Drew gets it. I must say, I'm a little bit surprised. It's been unbelievable so far. Two rounds down, two to go. Four riders going to go now against each other. The four riders that didn't go in that best trick round. And it's a head-to-head -head format. A minute in the arena. And it's Alex Colborn who drops in first. Look at that flare. Back. Oh, the hand comes off. I jinxed him. Really unfortunate there. Just a slip of grip. Totally out of character as he heads into the big section. Huge transfer. Oh, my goodness. Oh, he's leaning over the back wheel a bit. Declan Brooks poses a real threat, though. So consistent. Didn't start the best. No, he had to get pedaling back up to speed. A little bit squirrely. Oh, man. 
keeps it. So unfortunate. We saw him pull that perfectly in his first one. 10 4 now the score. Marin Rantes, just 24 years old, this man. Beautiful flair tail whip up in the top section. Next up then, big crowd, please are this man. Are you kidding me? Oh. Flip tail whip to late turn down. There is so much time available and he definitely used it well. The higher this, this man gets off these, off these ramps. And there's that big transfer. Judges will be loving that for the guts category. 360 double down whip. Oh. Strong run. Solid run, really good. It's a whitewash. Bogart again with a 5-0 score. Wow. He really did deserve it, in my opinion. Yeah, the gap gets bigger. 11 now for Team Drew. Four for Team Daniel. Nice big 360 from Jason up the step up. Oh, what? Ben Wallace from Basingstoke in the UK. Check it out. 360, look back. That's beautiful. He owns that trick. No one does it better than Ben. He's using every inch up in the top section. Oh. 540 tails oh, up. Beautiful. The volcano as he heads into the bottom section. Double whip quick. Going for the transfer. That will count for a few points. Strong run. Use of course. They've oh. done it. Wallace takes it. So fighting their way back into this. Team Daniel needs John John to win to fight their way back into this overall competition. Flip double tail whip. Up the step up, double down whip, landing very smooth. I can definitely see their point of view. Oh, is that triple tail whip there? Double tail whip. Double. Dying seconds. Always good to finish on a banger. Come oh. on, he wants the crowd to cheer. Look at the size of that rolling. So much speed. Off he goes. Truck driver to double bar, great start. Nailing this upper bowl section. As he heads towards the box. Double truck to table. Guts goes to Jean Jean, so Team Daniel on the comeback here, 11-6 now. Mind-blowing what we're seeing here tonight. And there's the overall. Level pegging in round one. Best trick went to Team Drew. They took five points there. And in round three, it's two apiece. Double points, eight points on offer in this last round. Four riders go, picked by the team captains. And each heat now carries two points. And we will not be seeing any scores in this round. We're going to keep them all secret. Irek Rizayev dropping in then. The Russian rider has been on fire tonight. He stayed up in the top section. He's going to want to head down right about oh. now. 360 tail whip to no hander. A solid run. Yeah, he hung on well there. When deck gets going, it's hard to stop him. So Can they fight back? Oh. A flip. Lands it. There Nails it. Wow. No the only else. man doing it, huh? Yeah, no one else doing a front flip over the spine. Come on, Madness, Jack. he was out of the top. Your five seconds. Ah, another front ah. flip to finish. I think I need to step it up next round. I'm against Pep, that's a great rider. Stylish, goes back on the big jump. Man, I need, I need to bring my A game this time. Watch this. <laughs> Wiedemeyer, the team captain, dropping in next. Here we go. Opposite curve, all right. Nice smooth tail up over the spine. Big flare landing. Whoa. That could be costly. Come on, Daniel. It's now or never, mate. Is he going to go for it again? Yes, he is. Wow. Lands it. Yeah. Big three across the gap. That was really cool. I've not seen that tonight. Shame he went down. Pat Casey it could go either way for this kid. Come on, don't give up, Pat. It's all to play for as he heads into the big section. Opting for the transfer. Oh, no! Oh. 
My goodness. Is that a double? Rob, that... <laughs> you said earlier tonight you won't see anyone else do a single. He just pulled a double. So much fun to watch Drew Wright. Oh, what a start. Wow, huge tower off of the top of the rafters into the course. Pulls that pick Oh, stall. yeah. Look at that. Oh! Oh, my. <laughs> Where did that come from? That didn't look like much, but trust me, that was one of the scariest moves of the contest. He's had a big crash this afternoon, and look at the risks he's still taking. So cool. He's a savage. Can Anthony Jean Jean spoil the party? It's going to take something special after that. There it is, the back tip fast into tail whip, double tail whip over the hip, landed so smooth. Oh! 360 double whip. My goodness. Big transfer. Yes. He's opted for the big oh. transfer. What? Wow, flip double whip. It's crazy. Honestly, the atmosphere is insane. It's even better than like a Led Zeppelin concert. You know what I mean? Like, it's that good. To be honest, Ben is one of my favorite riders. So it's going to be hard because we're kind of similar riders too. It's going to be a tough one. So I'm just going to go for it and see what I got. I really like Ben's riding up in this top section. Oh my goodness. Double tail whip going down to the big section. There's that big look back transfer. So cool. Oh! Oh, I'd be so stoked with that. The feeling of stomping a run like that. The last really one you got as well of the evening. Yeah. I'm kind of improvising this one. I think I'll uh, try to go as fast down this one and then I'll see what happens. From here in the Netherlands, Tom van den Bogart tonight. He's going to close the action here. Look at this as he heads into the big section. Oh, Whoa. 38 seconds left on the clock and he's gone to the lower deck. Flip X up to turn down. 360 triple down whip. My goodness. Well, he's enjoyed his last run of the evening, that's for sure. Wow. Well, it was 11-6 to Drew coming into this last round. Who do you think is going to take it? Well, let's go down to Daryl and uh, let him lead us through this. Well, the rider of the day, as selected by our fans here in Holland, is going to go to no other than Jake Leva! I'm speechless about it, man. It's, it's, it's never been done, so I'm, you know, I'll take it. All right, now, Megan, are you ready to find out our results? Can we get a countdown? Five, four, three, two, one. Team Drew! Wow, Team Crazy week, man. So many insane riding, good bikes and everyone. A good ender, insane tricks today, just ridiculous. I want to do this again. <laughs> it was an amazing experience, and I mean, I'll remember this day for the rest of my life. <laughs>